Hey, uh, so I finally managed to uh, get some tests in. Uh, so we've got our from GPS there, that's on uh, RTK float. Uh, the fuzzy logic module is working. Uh, you can see it's saying that it's disabled by the tablet at the moment because the little uh, steer icon's not in. So it's sending 32020. Uh, right, anyway, let's test this. So, coming around a corner, wait for it to find the uh, next line. There we go, hit the steer button. You can see it's uh, going straight, so it's sort of on a track to go to meet up with the line. There we go. So it's overshot quite significantly, so I need to sort that out. Uh, you can probably see my track there. Where I've been. Okay. It's also very uh, overreactive at the moment, so it really does wobble about the line, but it stays within about 20 to 30 centimeters, at least according to the light bar. Right, it's coming up to the end. Uh, let's disable it. There we go. Wait for it to find the line. And it only seems to. Uh, it only seems to be very. It's very reactive. It doesn't seem to preempt. Uh, so I'm not sure if perhaps a look ahead function may be useful in the uh, Agro Open GPS itself or whether it's something I can just tune out, hopefully the latter. Um, so in a minute we're going to, uh, my dad says on to get an extension cable, so we're going to try the antenna on the front of the bonnet and see if that makes any difference.